NASCAR is one of the most popular spectator sports in North America. The National Association for Stock Car Auto Racing holds a series of 36 races a year, mostly at oval or D-shaped tracks, on which the cars make only left turns. They're built from scratch, following NASCAR's strict technical rules. NASCAR stock cars are based on certain American-made road cars. The frame is made out of steel tubing. The hood, roof, and deck lid, that's like a regular car's trunk cover, are made out of sheet steel. The workers who assemble the body are called body hangers. They position all the parts according to a NASCAR authorized template. Here, they clamp the body panels together then with an aluminum bracket to the template for shaping. To make the wheel openings on the front fender, they use shrinking jaws, a tool that curves metal by squeezing it. Then they switch to a tool called an English wheel. It rolls the curved metal into a particular shape. The car's front suspension is essentially the same as that of a regular car, except for the angle of the tires, which they manipulate by putting shims on this upper control arm. The right front tire tilts inward, and the left front tire tilts outward. That's because these cars race on an oval track in one direction only, so they're making only left turns. Next, they install a brake rotor, then a steel spacing plate between the rotor and the wheel. This sets up the specific distance from wheel to wheel that NASCAR rules require. They load a pair of brake pads into a brake caliper and slide the caliper onto the rotor. The caliper contains different size pistons so that it applies the brake pads to the rotor evenly. Now they move on to the car's inner workings. They mount the transmission to an aluminum housing that covers the flywheel, clutch, and other components. Then they install the motor. It's an eight-cylinder, 750-plus horsepower engine. They attach the car's plastic windshield with bolted clips. If air gets into the car, these strong clips will keep the windshield from blowing out. The car seat core is made of aluminum, padded for comfort. Every NASCAR driver has his car seat custom built to his body shape. After bolting in the seat, they install the steering wheel. It has a safety release that lets the driver remove the wheel with a single pull. This enables him to get in and out of the car easily and to remove the wheel quickly if he's injured in a crash. Now for the finishing touches. First, a large decal of the car's number centered on each door. Every NASCAR race car is also plastered with decals advertising its driver's sponsors. NASCAR stock cars have a few key safety features. Fenders allow side-to-side -side contact between cars without their wheels hooking together. Roof flaps direct air downward, keeping the cars close to the ground. This stops a spinning car from flipping over. A NASCAR stock car weighs in at more than 1,500 kilograms. It travels to the track in the top deck of a trailer. This keeps the bottom level clear as a workspace for the driver's mechanical crew.
never slow up. No, I don't take shit. I got no 